I guess just first off, Coach, I mean, what's your first emotion? Is it just the pride of how hard you guys played or the disappointment of being so close and not getting it? I'm probably 50-50. Um, but the, the overarching uh, emotion for me right now is gratitude. I am grateful for the people that I'm surrounded by every day. I am grateful for their hearts and their effort. It would have been easy for them to lay down and not fight. Boy, that was fun. I, I told uh, Mike Gallagher uh, a few minutes ago on the radio, I felt like Russell Crowe in Gladiator. Are you not entertained? Well, what a great environment. I am, I'm grateful for the opportunity, and I'm grateful that I found out who my team is very quickly. And uh, I like who they are, and I like even more who we're going to become uh, because the mistakes that we made are correctable. Um, it wasn't schematic, it wasn't effort, it wasn't attitude. We missed free throws, and we can fix that. So, great environment, very humble, very grateful, and I uh, think proud. Um, but at the same time, I'll be dreaming about free throws. Obviously, Eric has had some great games here. Can you just put in perspective that kind of performance that you've been seeing? That's the best player in the Southern Conference. And right now, compared to all the other teams out there, she's probably the best player in the Southeastern Conference. She had 41 points, 10 rebounds, 7 steals, and threw up every time out. I don't know if you guys recognize what ETSU Tough is, but you're looking at it. Elise goes out, they're, they're checking her after taking a charge, and then she makes the hustle play of the game, diving to tap the ball forward to Erica. This kid right here is one of the most talented kids I've ever seen. And I've played and coached in the SEC, I played uh, coached in the Big 12. Find another, find another athlete like that. But more importantly, Erica is a remarkable teammate. And that's why she's so fun to play with. Her teammates love her. Her heart is bigger than anything on that floor. And <laughs> if I could coach the things that Erica could do, boy, I'd coach all of them, but I can't. She was gifted, she works hard to hone her craft, um, and Erica is the ultimate competitor. And she knows that she is loved, and she knows that we are always gonna stand behind her, and when you know those things, you just go out and play. And all of our kids know that. I believe in everybody that wears that uniform. Sort of thing, same thing I asked the coach, Erica. You have such a monster game like that, and you're so close. What are your emotions at this point? Tennessee is a great team. Um, like she said, free throws is what got us. Um, I just I got one more, one more chance to get Tennessee, so I'm going to go out the next year. <laughs> Her overarching emotion is probably exhausted. Would you say that's fair? Yeah. Whatever mom it takes on. <laughs> so, I mean, how were you able to just push through that, have that kind of performance? I mean, a lot of people, they're going to throw it out there in timeouts. They're like, I'm out. I can't do this anymore. I really want to just like reach out and find that. Uh, I wanted, wanted to win. Uh, throw up, get back out there. My teammates had my back. I cried a couple times, but I couldn't get it, but they cheered me back up, got me back up on my feet, and went back out there. At least to talk about coming back from, you know, where you take that hard hit, hit your head, and then, you know, coming back into the game. Um, I just, uh, my, my teammates have a back, like she said, so like I knew that I had to help them out too, so like just push through it, so like that's what happened after it. Coach, this is really like a coming out party for her. Yeah. These, we haven't seen anything from that for her. Talk about, did you know that that was in her? I think we all know that's in her. Uh, Elise, during the summer, was the best player on the floor many a time. She and Erica would go back and forth at each other. Um, I know what Elise is capable of. I mean. Lisa was a Native American, All-American coming out of high school, played on a great high school program, winning the AAU program. She was just biding some time. And it takes certain people a little bit longer to grasp the system. Um, but I think it's slowing down for her now. Um, Elise is the happiest kid on the team. Um, you're, gonna, you're gonna constantly see her smiling and, and being joyous. And, and now she's starting to find some joy in the work. And uh, she's been putting in the work, so. That makes it uh, not a surprise for us, but uh, I'm glad that you were pleasantly surprised with what you saw. Uh, any more questions? Thank you guys. Go Bucks.